Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle I hope um, everybody's okay and um, is well um, I hope you enjoyed um, my footage video saying uh, goodbye to uh, Wilco um, store on Monday and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed um, then please press the ex subscribe button and don't forget to ring the notification bell um, so you don't miss an upload and a big thumbs up and thank you for doing that um, today I'm going to be doing a video uh, travel news worldwide 10 exciting facts September 2023 so um, and this is according to um, breakingtravelnews.com so the first exciting and fabulous fact is number one exclusives from the future of hospitality summit which is underway in Abu Dhabi and in the uh, United Arab Emirates and um, the future of hospitality summer um, it's a three-day um, special event of the de uh, deal making and strong debate and um, a more of the top players in the in the Middle East tourism and the hospitality sectors um, are going to be there so I hope that um, a deal making event uh, goes as well as possible fingers crossed number two um, mid east hotels have the world's highest occupancy rate says senior executive hotels in the middle east are performing really well with uh, the highest at rates um, in the world it said a senior uh, fourth director of the global data benchmaking um, firm str so that's really good news so at least for the middle east it's a, a really exciting and really good news and um moving on to so well well done to mid east hotels and uh, number three moving on um the earthquake that hit morocco um offers investors of prop profit opportunities to spur its tourism sector after the deadliest earthquake um, in more than 60 years Morocco is calling for investors to in inject uh, capital in its tourism sector with opportunities ranging from developing beach resorts to building theme parks so um, again hopefully really exciting news uh, for Morocco after uh, the disaster of the earthquake and um, again I hope there's uh, going to be more jobs and more variety um, for, uh, for people and it'll be uh, then safe to go on holiday again there with built up resorts and theme parks so go on Morocco I wish you the very best of luck and uh, number four Al Hyper personalizations to catapult um, hospitality industry uh, to no heights um, F H S. So, good luck to uh, hyper personalizations, and I hope it does a catapult 
into the hospitality industry uh, with new heights and um, number five Saudi Arabia United Arab Emirates Egypt and Egypt lead a 1.9 trillion hospitality and residential push so uh, good luck to those three countries um, that are leading to um, a hospitality and residential at posh number six travel and tourism to witness major reassurance due to the chi uh, due to chinese travelers so oh sorry um travel and tourism to witness a major resurgence due to Chinese uh, travellers I hope that goes as well as possible and um, number seven Hilton um, the brand adds the Plaza Doha to its LXR hotel and resorts po uh, portfolio so I hope the Plaza Doha and the Hilton uh, brand um, I hope it goes as well as possible and uh, number eight Raz Al Kamar to uh, get its own Nikki beach resort and spa so wow um, so good luck to Raz Al Kamar and it's Nikki at Beach Resort and Spa. I hope um, everybody enjoys it and enjoys working there. Number nine, EasyJet cabin crew recruitment campaign challenge, challenges the stereotypes, encouraging career changes. So good luck to anybody that wants to. Um, be a cabin crew member for EasyJet uh, because they're encouraging people that want to change careers and um, number 10 math role at life and um, in balance spa Avora opens at uh, Park Hyatt Aurora Resort Golf Club and Spa. So, good luck to Moravol Mar Mar Life in Balance Spa Avora, and I hope it does as well as possible. And um, I hope it goes as well as possible for the Hyatt Avora resort so i would like to say thank you for watching and excuse my pronunciation if i haven't quite uh, pronounced um the place right and i would like to say thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow for travel news uk five exciting facts september 2023 part four so please keep watching and have a good night or um, a good day wherever you are in the world. Thank you and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.